Hey guys, Kino DVT here with a replay of a 1v1 I played, I think it was about two and a half months ago, so I was pretty crap back then. Um, but the reason I'm showing you this uh, replay is to detail the importance of scouting in your games. So, I'm here, I'm the Red Protoss versus Grandcore, Grandcore the Blue Protoss. Um, and yeah, like I was saying, this game was for me just all about really good scouting and I really locked him down because I scouted. So let's get on it. Uh, this was back in the days when I was still trying to manage a manual split. Uh, I don't do that anymore because it's really slow. It does really slow you down. Um, the so like I was saying, the importance of scouting, so firstly on, oh, I'm blanking what the map is called, sorry, this map or any of the four player maps, it's always good to know which position they are on the four positions. Um, obviously depending on the race, you'll have an advantage. Um, also, if you're say here and here, that gives air a massive advantage in that infantry has to go and air just have to fly over. So an early air push, if these were your two positions, would be very likely. Um, I kind of scouted badly. Uh, this natural scouting position is from there to there, or here to here, and my scout is now going to find him. Um, this, the strat Grand Core is doing, uh, I won't spoil it, is pretty old. I haven't actually seen anyone, I guess the word is stupid enough, or thinking that it would work, um, still, so, um, and this is the first thing that puzzled me, is he's actually blocked off. Um, so there's no way in or out of his ramp, and the first thing that came to me was, oh, he's doing an air rush. So I was just waiting for that, waiting for voids, and as you do. Uh, yeah. Sorry, pardon me. And he's got a gateway, he's got a worker here. I suspect he's going to lay down a cyber. He doesn't have as many workers as I would like, but neither do I, to be perfectly honest. Again, this is back when I wasn't quite... Oh! Hey guys, Kino DVT here with another replay between me, myself, or my old name self, uh, versus Grand Core, the Blue Protoss. Um, the reason I'm showing you this very old and probably bad game uh, by myself is this game was basically won or lost by the fact that I scouted. Um, if I hadn't scouted it, I would have been annihilated and it wasn't cheap. So let's get on to this. Uh, as I said, this game is quite old and I'm still trying to do a manual split, which I'm not the biggest fan of. It just seems, I mean, you get a small amount of income slightly faster. Um, oh, this is back when you can get to see the bars in the production. That's a pain. Um, anyway, regardless. So yeah, this, this, I, st I don't, is this? No. But no, it's not Twilight Fortress. I'm blanking on the map, sorry, but this map's quite interesting, and obviously just starting off scouting, knowing where they are is a really good idea. Um, recently I've been finding myself scouting a lot earlier faster, because I've been getting cheesed a lot recently, and I find if you count the work account, if they don't have a very good work account, then you can just tell whether it's cheese or not right off the bat. Um, for instance, if you scout a six pool with one of your, like, the first work you built, then you'll have around seven workers by the time, sorry, nine workers by the time you scouted their work account on a one, one map. And if you just stop all work production and counter with units, you will win. Um, now, really important is I got into his base because he has blocked off. Now, it's really unusual, but it does happen with Terran, and it's always good to get past that wall. Um, 
Probably what I should have done is set a patrol loop rather than a manual click loop, but mistakes are mistakes. Um, so I'm, I'm slightly puzzled at this point as to what he's doing. If I was blocking off, I would think voids, but not necessarily. It could be blink stalkers, could be colossi, or he could just be really used to versing like six balls and stuff and not wanting the like zerglings to be running up. This was back when I was bronze or silver 1v1, I can't remember which. Um, so maybe he was just used to workers running up and he just wanted to stop that. I mean he's got his zealot training and obviously it'll come out on the other side. Um, he's put down a side of course so it still could be air rush, still could be something. Um, but at the moment I'm still thinking air rush or he's going to blast a hole in it. So I'm thinking I've got to get a constant scout into his base. Now I'm just, my income is better than him because I've been producing workers this entire time. And it's going to start picking up even more because he pulled them off to put them on gas. Um, some funky worker shit happening. Uh, yeah, I probably should have said Sorry. Uh, so, no, you, no more production. He's now building workers again. I'm placing down Cybercorp. This is a really odd strat of mine because it's absolute crap. This wouldn't have gotten me into gold. Won't be wrong. Um, I think I may have accidentally just blocked off my ramp. Uh, not sure. Um, so I'm still slightly puzzled. I'm, my basic thinking is I need to know what he's got. Because if I don't know what he's got, he's going to kill me. Because I won't be countering. So I believe I throw down a robo. Production. D. Uh, at some point. Uh, that's right. Proxy panel. Uh, that's very important. If you're going any kind of gateway units and you're getting warp gates, always get a proxy pile on somewhere near their base. It is the most amazing thing you can do. So obviously he's got a second gateway. Um, he's just producing stalkers out of them, which does make sense, because if you get blink stalkers, then you can just blink in and out, which would make sense. Um, grand core. Yeah, sorry. Um, so I'm just scouting here. I see a stalker, uh, which is what I, I really just wanted to see what kind of units he had. Um, also, you'll notice that I spotted the second gateway, which beforehand I hadn't. Um, he is on the opposite end of the scan. He has no scouting information whatsoever. He doesn't know what position I am, which I think is really bad play. He doesn't know what position I am, he doesn't know what I've done, he doesn't know who I am. Like, apart from the fact he knows I'm Provost, he knows diddly squat, nothing, not a, not a visible. Um, which is, again, really bad play, because I could be waltzing over with like four carriers or something, and he wouldn't know about it. Um, in hindsight, if I played this game again, and saw on two gateway, a cyber core, and a block off, I would have extended. I would have gone fast expo and then just hammered him to death. Because even though I won, it took a while. Hmm, no wonder it was running a bit slow. Sorry, I had the game normal there for a while by accident. Um, I think he might go out and scout with this stalker, I'm not sure. 